有点洒在的水。Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell for like it. I sure it's for the money. So the song is a little repetitive in the way that it's played. So for the song, it's not gonna be in standard tuning. It's just gonna be in open string, so you don't need a capo. So the first thing I'm gonna be playing is gonna be an F minor nine over G. Then that's gonna be six string third fret, fourth string third fret, third string open, and second string first fret. And then you're gonna play the six string once, and then third string together once, six string twice, and then third string together once, and then you plug the six string third string and second string together, third second string once. Then repeat that one more time, and then third, and then you're gonna play the exact same thing, but you're gonna move your finger from second string first fret to third string first fret. So now you're gonna play six string third fret, four string third fret, third string first fret, second string open. Play the exact same pluck and pattern just played. And then you're gonna go to a C minor nine over E. But that's gonna be fifth string, third fret, fourth string, second fret, third string, fourth fret, second string, third fret. Play the fifth string, third and second string together. F fifth string twice, third and second string together. And then fifth, third and second string, and then third and second string once by itself. Then repeat that part one more time. And then you're gonna play a uh, A minor nine. That's gonna be fifth string open, fourth string, fifth fret, third string, fifth fret, second string, fifth fret, first string, seventh fret. Play the same pocket pattern, just play for the C minor nine over E. So this is how the first sounds like. I guess I'll take the. C minor nine over E. A minor 9 They repeat the whole thing all over and one more time And then you go to an F major 7 Play that's going to be 6 string 1st fret 4 string 2nd fret 3rd string 2nd fret and second string first fret. And then you're gonna play the exact same plucking pattern as you play for the F minor nine over G. And then you go to a B flat thirteen. That's gonna be six string, six six fret, fifth string, six fret, four string, six fret, third string, seventh fret, second string, eighth fret. Then you play a six string, fourth, third, second. And then you play the F minor 9 over G once. And then go to the next one. But for the next one, you just play the 6 string once. Then the second string together once. 6 string twice. And then the third second string together once. And then you put the 6 third second string together once. So this is how the end part sounds like. To the chorus. So for the chorus, you're gonna start out the same way you started out the verse. So just play the whole progression that you play in the verse, and then once you're repeating it for the second time, start out the same way. But then instead of going to C minor nine over E, you go to the A minor nine. So that is just true. And then you go to F major seven. B then you strum down a B flat thirteen. And then go to the next verse. The next verse is gonna be the same way you play the previous verse, in which you play that whole progression twice. 
And now they play that whole progression twice. Go to the F major seven. And then B flat thirteen. And then it's strum down on the A minor nine. That's pretty much how the song ends. So it's how the whole song sounds like all together. Also, the reference I used for this video is the live version she has on her channel. It's called Eloise Left Side Live. It's on her page on her YouTube channel. So that's what I use for the reference as this video. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to more videos like this. Share it to friends if you might need it. Leave a comment down below on what to like to see next. And I'll see you next time.